All right, so we're taking a look at local values, also known as locals, that assigns a name to an expression so you can use it multiple times within a module without repeating it. So here, what we're gonna do is define our local block up here. And then the idea is that we're assigning uh, these names or IDs, uh, expressions or values so that we can reuse them throughout our code. Uh, notice that we can define multiple local blocks in the same file. Um, and I just say this because like when you use required providers, you're only allowed to have a single block, but in this case, like with variables or locals, you can have many, um, and you can even nest them within each other. So notice down here, we're referencing local uh, within a local, so that's totally possible. And I imagine it's in the order to which uh, it is specified. We can do static values or computed values. So we can actually, here's a function, right, an expression, and then it'll output a value. Um, once a local value is declared, you can refer reference it via the dot as local dot the name. So here, notice it, within our AWS resource, we have local and common tags. I have to point this out, but when you're referencing, you use the singular local uh, because you might get an exam question where it shows you local dot or locals dot. And uh, the trick here is you got to remember which one it is. Locals help uh, can help dry up your code. It is best practice to use local sparingly since it's uh, in Terraform, it's intended to be declarative and overuse of locals can make it difficult to determine what the code is doing. This all comes back to describing Terraform as declarative plus where they give you functionality that's imperative like, but the idea is that, uh, you know, if you overuse these, you can run into trouble, okay?